I was just, at the time when I saw it, I was pissed off. And I was ready to call my bank and tell them that it was motherfucking fraud. Happy Sunday to everybody. So I literally just came out of Kohl's. Um, I had to come over here and return my Amazon package so I can get my credit so I can go ahead and repurchase the correct port that I need. Um, so I did that and then I stopped in. I'm like, where's the bag? I stopped in Sephora. This little mini bag is so cute. And I finally got my hands on Summer Fridays, you guys. They only had two flavors in there. It looked like they carried at least like five flavors in this lip balm. Um, the flavors that, that the flavors that was left was like a it was like a peachy color, and then it was this color, which is kind of more so on the chocolate side. Uh, the flavor is brown sugar. So, I'm excited. This lip balm better be everything. It better be, it's, it's big. It's a, definitely a nice size. So, real quick, I'm going to compare it to the e.l.f. lip balm. So, y'all see the difference? Yeah, y'all see? So, this one is way more smaller. And, yeah, I hope this lives up to his name because... A lot of girls be raving about this. It smells good. So once my um, I just put some Elf lip balm on when I got in the car because my lips was ashy. But once that rubs off, um, I'll put this on. So now I am about to shoot back over to Burlington because I did try those sandals on the girls. Um, the sandals for Erin, they fit her good. Now, Ilani. Yeah. Ilani's was just a tad bit too small. Um, so, I'm going to go ahead and get her the next size up, which will be an 11. Um, I'm not sure like how many pairs of sandals they had in a size 11 because that's not the size that I was looking for yesterday but um hopefully they have a couple pairs that I can you know pick through um if not I really don't feel like going over to Walmart or not Walmart I really don't feel like going over to Old Navy but I really might have to because it's it's hot outside and she needs she needs sandals, you know? Like don't nobody want to be wearing sneakers all the time. So what I'm gonna have to do is because I wanna go past Bath and Body Works because they're having their um semi-annual sale and I really shouldn't be. I just told myself like <laughs> I really shouldn't be um spending money like that because I need a I literally all right let me finish my thought hold on if I go to the Dunkin next to Burlington I'm gonna have to wait I'm gonna have to go to the mall first then I'm gonna have to go to Dunkin then I can get my coffee do I want to wait that long I don't know but I gotta make my decision quick because this other Dunkin is coming up but um what was I saying oh yeah I told myself that you know I wasn't gonna spend that much money um, because I just got hit with this. Oh my god, <laughs> this charge just hit my credit card, and honestly, it's nobody else's fault but mine because I knew about it and I kept thinking about it. But the thing is, I was like, damn, like I felt like they should have charged my card already, and then they didn't. So, like, you know, days just went on and. Uh, I made a credit card payment the other 
day and I paid my card off and I felt really good about that. And then I go and look at my, um, I go and log on to my bank and I see my credit card just shot back up and I was like, what is going on? And that was the charge that I was, so I'm annoyed. Like I said, I, I can't be mad at nobody but myself because I knew it was coming and I had an opportunity to cancel it and I didn't. And I was just, at the time when I saw it, I was pissed off and I was ready to call my bank and tell them that it was motherfucking fraud. But if I do that, then they're going to make me get a new card, which, which I don't want to do. Because I got my card number memorized and everything, and I just don't want to have to go through that. But, yeah. So you got to get up early. You got to get up early like the old folks and come to the mall nice and quiet out here and birds still chirping mm -hmm. oh really oh it's open okay i'm a little too early the store ain't even open what the hell i secured the bag Secured the bag. So I got my candles. Only got three candles. I didn't want to go crazy. Um, but I'm happy that I got them. I will only, and I'm telling you, only, only, maybe only, only, only <laughs> buy candles from Bath and Body Works when they are on sale. Um and I could have swore the semi-annual so that's what's going on now I could have swore that only went on once a year but um, I don't know maybe not hello I don't know what point the camera cut off but I was saying I ended up exchanging Elani sandals so I got this pair of gold sandals right here Hold on, y'all, because I ain't even ready to pull up to the window. It'd be folk like me. Let me see. Um, so I got that gold pair, and then I got these pair right here. Um, so these aren't like the most like how do I how should I say it? they aren't like the most little kiddish little girlish y'all get what I'm saying but I think they're still cute I think they're still appropriate I'm just happy I found a white pair that can go with the majority of her stuff hello thank you you too do need more sandals um, I want them both to have a pair of black sandals each um, and then I gotta find Aaron a pair of just like all white sandals but all right y'all I just wanted to update you guys so I'm done my errands and um, I'm on my way back home so once I get home um, I really don't want to do much today just because today's Sunday tomorrow is the start of the new week um, 
I do have to cook dinner because I haven't cooked dinner. In, I haven't cooked dinner in a couple days. So I want to get some dinner cooked. Um, oh, I got to do my hair. I don't know how that's gonna work out because once I get home, I know Brock is leaving out. I don't know how long he's gonna be. So I don't know how that's gonna work. I mean, I'm gonna get my hair done today regardless, or at least I'm gonna try my very best to. But I gotta, um, I gotta take these braids out. I gotta wash my hair and then I gotta rebraid it, and then I can um, install my wig. I bought. I was gonna do a bob. I love bobs if they look a certain type of way. Like I like for my bobs to be short, very blunt cut. And yeah, and I like them to be like a little thick, a little bit, like not too much, but like at the same time, I don't like my bobs to be thin. So I was gonna do a bob, and then I came across another wig. Um, it's still semi short, it's a 14 inch, um, so it'll probably come to just about maybe my shoulders or maybe just a little past my shoulders and it was like body wave so if I get um if I get some flexi rods or something and put it in my hair I have some at home but I do want to buy another pack um I think it could be it could be cute so we'll see all right it's a couple hours later um I think the last time I talked to y'all I may have been in the car I feel like it was in a car after I got my Duncan. Um, but I just wanted to show y'all the candles that I got. So I know I already showed you guys the lip balm in a car. But now that nothing is on my lips, I'm going to put it on and I'm going to show y'all. So it's like a chocolate color. Like I said, this is in the flavor brown sugar. I'll swatch it for y'all so y'all can see it on my skin. So I didn't do a lot at all. But this is what it looks like if you guys can see. So it's like a dark chocolate, kind of. Yeah. Let me see. Actually, it's kind of sheer. Okay. So, I would say when it comes to these lip balms, it feels good. Um, it's not that thick, though. I thought it would be thicker. It smells good. It smells like cocoa. It don't necessarily smell like brown sugar. It's more on a cocoa side, but yeah. So I would say with these lip glosses, and and real quick though, to compare this one to the Elf one, Elf. Right off the bat, I already can tell the Elf one is a little bit more thicker, which is what I like. But um, this one is a little thick, like nothing crazy though. Um. But what I can tell from these, like, you know, it obviously appears chocolate, but once you put it on, it's, it's sheer. And that's probably how all of them are. I think it's safe to assume that. But I wanted to show you guys the candles. Um, I didn't go crazy. I just got three of them. So the first one is Wildberry Jam Donut. And I know that probably sounds like it's really sweet, but it's really not. Like you can definitely tell it is obviously a sweet scent, but it's not like, it's not overbearing. So I think this will smell really good while it's burning.
All right, the next one that I got is Velvet Amber Woods. So this is like the scents I gravitate to all the time. Like scents like this, um, sometimes coconut. Um, I can't think, like brown sugar. Um, uh like caramel scents like things like that if y'all if y'all if y'all are picking up what i'm putting down so in here it says fine saffron lavish jasmine bright amber with natural essential oils and this smells this smells really good it's more so on the soft side which i like That smells really good. I love that one. I may end up burning that one first. And then last but not least, I remember what this scent is. This, is, oh, oh, I thought I got, um, I thought I got champagne toast. I know for sure I saw it and I picked it up, but what I probably did was put it back and then I picked up this wild berry jam donut. That's exactly what I did. Um, this is another one. So toasted cinnamon sugar. So you see like those are the scents that I like gravitate to. And this one smells good. It, I could definitely smell the cinnamon. It smells like a Cinnabon. So yeah, those are the three candles that I got. Like I said, I didn't want to go crazy or nothing like that. Um, and this was a treat for me today. I didn't um intend on buying this but this thing is this, so this is 24 dollars but i had a coupon a 10 percent coupon and it bought it to 21.60 i believe yeah 21.60 so yeah if i wouldn't have bought this i would have bought another candle i'm trying to um just not splurge or not buy a lot of stuff this pay period because I already told y'all that damn charge that hit my account. Now I gotta pay my credit card off again, but it is what it is. It is what it is. I'm about to just put a hundred on my card now. So that way um, I can just already get that out of the way. Um, all right, so y'all can see I got a towel on. So I was able to wash my hair. So I had put the baby to sleep. I need to stop calling her a baby. She is, but I put Erin to sleep, so she's taking a nap. She did wake up as soon as I was, as soon as I sat down. I mean, as soon as I sat down, clicked on a YouTube video to watch. I hadn't even grabbed my little bit of food because I ate my leftover Chipotle. I didn't even grab that yet, and I heard her. I was like, oh my God. And I didn't feel like she was going to go back to sleep, but I just patted her a little bit, and she did, so... Hopefully she stays asleep for another maybe half an hour, an hour if we're lucky. But anyway, after I um, after I put her to sleep, came downstairs, um, started dinner. So the only thing that I have to do now is just make the broccoli. If that's the vegetable that I'm going to make, which I feel like it is. I'm leaning towards that. Um, so tonight I'm making, excuse me, chicken breast. I made this chicken breast before and, um, when I tell you it was so tender, so I'm making chicken breast, um, I put bell peppers in it and so I just have it, uh, marinating, I guess, if that's the right word. I, I have it sitting in, um some heavy whipping cream right now still on the stove but so that's gonna be so good um already got the mashed potatoes out the way and yeah like i said all i have to do is make the um the vegetable most likely it's gonna be broccoli so once the broccoli is done dinner is out the way and it is 3 30 in the afternoon so got that out the way um i did put a load in the wash uh the girl stuff so i just got to get a load of my clothes and wash that um and then the laundry will be out the way i just gotta do my hair so um that's what i'm about to do now i'm about to go upstairs very quietly because i don't want to wake her up y'all see these bags under my eyes mm -hmm. 
maybe I'll get those eye patches and put them on while I braid my hair down. So I gotta braid my hair down, I gotta put the wig on, and yeah, my hair will be out of the way. And then I will have everything accomplished for today and I can relax for the rest of the day. Um, Brock and Ilani are still out, so yeah. All right, let me go ahead and get that done. I'll tap back in with y'all later. Bye. Hey y'all. It is 8.36 at night and we're about to take it down. So we just came upstairs in the room. Hi, mommy. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> we just came upstairs in the room because I'm about to put Aaron to sleep. Um, today was a good day. I got everything accomplished. I didn't really get overwhelmed or anything like that. Um, yeah, everything that was on my list to do, I got it checked off. I got my hair done. So I took it out, I washed it, I rebraided it, I put this wig on, um, and I told y'all it is, it's about a, it's a 14 inch. So it's still short, but it's long enough for me to put in a ponytail, as you can see. Um, so what I really should do is put, um, I should put some flexi rods in it tonight the only thing <sighs> i need some more smaller ones like i was telling y'all earlier but i didn't even i didn't stop at the uh hair store and get any but um yeah i'm i'm proud of myself i did i did everything i needed to do today it sounded like a lot when i said it but um I got it done, like I always do, and that's what makes us women so bomb, because we just do it, we do it, we do it tired, we do it uh, not feeling well, we do it angry, we do it happy, we, we just do it, we get the job done. So I just um, flossed and brushed my teeth. So now I'm about to put this e.l.f. lip balm on. I keep this in my um, in my drawer right here. And then I'm about to put my nighttime cream on. I believe I showed you guys. Um, but this is the cream and this is actually by e.l.f. too. This is the e.l.f. cream that I use at nighttime. It's just a light moisturizer. And I literally just put a dime size on these four areas. And then I just rub it in. And honestly, without me even putting this cream on, I still tend to wake up in the morning with my skin kind of oily. Um, but, you know, I just put this on after I wash my face because my face be feeling dry as hell. So I just put this on so I don't feel dry. And then same for my lips. It smells good. This is the grape one. And... The one that I just ordered not too long ago is still in the box. This is the vanilla, yeah, vanilla frosting. I'm debating whether I want to eat the rest of my ice cream tonight. I kind of don't want to do it because I just brushed my teeth. And that will be pointless. That's not the dye. Alright, your tablet died. All right, um, yeah, it died, mama. We going to sleep, okay? We about to go night-night. So, yeah, on that note, we're about to go to sleep because her tablet died. Um, I'm going to take my pill before I go 
Oh. Bye. 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 Mommy. Mom. Bye, Mommy. Mommy. No, this is my vitamin. You mad? It's a, it's a mommy. Mm -hmm. Mama. Hey, nine bicies. Stop. All right, y'all. I will catch y'all in the morning. Good night. Lonnie, say hi. Hi, I'm going to gymnastics. You going to gymnastics? Yeah. Yep. And I'm excited. You excited? <laughs> That's good. I'm glad you're excited. Hey y'all, so I'm getting a very, very, very late start to the day. It is 5.10. Um, we're on our way to gymnastics so we finally got Ilani signed up for um, a different activity um, other than she's been doing flag football and she did cheer as well um, but yeah like I said we finally got her signed up for something else so I don't know what the plan will necessarily be like once this is over we can continue to um, sign her up for gymnastics um, it runs for about a month so we can keep doing it or you know if they have other open spots for other things such as they have like swimming on there they have soccer on there I believe so if there's other openings um, we can get her you know signed up right after this but we'll just see how it plays out and we'll see what she wants to do the ultimate goal was just to try out different things um, so we're able to see what she likes the most but yeah we're on our way there now I'm excited for her um, she's at the age now where you know she she understands things more and you know mainly in a house she'll be trying to do handstands on the wall and I'm like okay yeah I think she's ready so hopefully she doesn't go in there and act shy <laughs> don't go in there and be acting shy I mean it's okay if you act shy you probably won't know nobody in there but it's gonna be little other girls in there just like you and everybody is gonna be Everybody's gonna learn how to do gymnastics, okay? You gonna have fun? Yep. And we're gonna be standing right there, probably watching outside of a window, I'm guessing. But we're gonna be standing right there watching you, okay? Um, all right, so we're about to pull up in a couple seconds, so I'll see y'all there. <clears throat> yeah. Thank you. Hi. 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 So freaking ghetto. Thank you. Hi. Can I have nap Hi. a lot of napkins, please? Hi. I said Oreo. They won't. Thank you. A couple Hi. more. Hi. Okay. Thank you. Hi. Hold on, Mama. Mind y'all. So y'all. Okay. Listen. Um. Oh God, I know you'll do okay. Please don't drop that, okay? <laughs> Hold on, Aaron. Hold on. Let me give you a spoon. That's a cone. Yeah, that's a cone. But please try not to make a mess, okay? Is that, is that the cone? Yeah. You wanna? You want me hold the cone for you so you can eat your ice cream? I'ma hold Aaron's cone. Hold on. Oh, you want me to hold your cone for you, Lonnie? Huh? Okay. Is that the cone right there? Is that a sticker? Yes, Mama. That's a that's your cone. I asked for an Oreo. Um, 
I thought it was gonna be blended up how the flurry would be. Yeah, Why they put the Oreos at the bottom like this? Why they do me like that? I wanna taste a little bit. That's Oreo at the bottom, Lonnie. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Oh Lord. just went to the gymnastics spot and Hi. to our little surprise uh, Mommy. Rock had signed her up for the wrong location no big deal but you know how little kids are you tell them about something they get really excited Ilani was really excited and we had to tell her, okay, we can't do it today. We gotta wait a couple days. So it'll pro most likely it won't be tomorrow. It'll probably be next week. But um, yeah, so he has signed us up for, signed her up for the wrong location. <clears throat> so um, we just have to make the switch. And then, so this location that we went to that's closer to us, of course, they don't offer classes on Mondays, which Mondays would have worked out best for everybody. So we're probably gonna switch to, oh, you know what? What time did he say for Tuesday? You know what? Cause he offered a couple times for Tuesdays and a couple times for Thursdays. I think he said 5:10 on Tuesdays. Um, but of course she'll be in school. So whatever day, whatever day is later. So we'll either do a Tuesday or Thursday. Um, but yeah, I felt bad. Um, I had like walked around just so she could see like all the equipment and stuff um, like the you know the trampolines and the mats and stuff like that and I felt really bad even though you know it's, it's nobody's fault but uh, I felt bad so I got them a little treat from um, McDonald's now uh, disclaimer Mommy, I know McDonald's isn't healthy. I was just about to say, we don't eat McDonald's, y'all. Um, if we do fast food for the girls, it's Chick-fil-A. Um, yeah, we don't eat McDonald's, but I just got them some ice cream from McDonald's. So, And I used, the, uh, I used some of the gift cards my aunt had got us for Christmas. <laughs> She's so cute. Thank you, auntie. The gift cards were uh, five each, and she gave us like four of them, so... Just now I use like three and a half. But I got myself a caramel frap. Um, the other day I was craving one of these randomly. So look at the little bit of the little bit of caramel they put on the top. You okay, Erin? I know. Erin back here making a mess. Keep the napkins right there, okay? All right, eat your food. Eat it. I'm gonna eat your ice cream. We'll see you 
cream, Mama. Eat your ice cream. You better not be ripping that stuff up. Don't do that. This is actually really good. Honestly, I can't remember the last time that I can't remember the last time that um that I drank one of these, but what I do remember, and this was Elani, because this is when we was living at the apartment. When I was pregnant with Elani, I drank so many of these. Oh my God. Like, I felt like every day <laughs> when Rock was coming home, I would be like, can you bring me a caramel frap? Can you bring me a caramel frap? Can you bring me a caramel Like, I was addicted to these. I can't really remember so much with Aaron, but, Baby, these was my best friend when I was pregnant with Elani. 